we also have to learn that we should be very watchful and careful when we interact with brothers and sisters the words we use the body language we use the emotions we attach with our words you know sometimes we say the same thing but the way we say it the words we use it makes a big difference so we have to make sure that we create environment that where we are talking in a very friendly environment maulana amin hasan islahi sahab has said you know in tazkiya and nafs book that if you are are going with somebody if you want to present your perspective about something in response of somebody's you know question and if your voice is going up and you are getting angry that means that you should stop there and you should do your tazkiya you need your tazkiya whenever you are responding to brothers and sister you should not get angry your voice should not go high your heart beat should not start beating very fast that means you do not have any control on your emotion how many time it happens that we injure the hearts of our brothers with our words with our body language the way we express our emotions to them be very careful because we do not want to be among those people about whom prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam has said that do you know the real poor person people say the one who has no money prophet said no the real gharib the real poor person is the one he goes in yawm e akhira and when his accountability is happening he comes with lots of good deeds mountains of good deeds but then he has slandered somebody he has abused somebody he has cursed somebody he has used foul language against somebody and all these people come and file claim against him and all of his good deeds are given to these people and when all his good deeds are finished but still there are people in the line so now allah subhanahu wa taala is going to order take out the sin of these claimers and put in this person's account the one who came with mountains of good deeds and he's left in his baggage the bad deeds of other people that's why we should be very careful when we are dealing with people at home in community at workplace every word we say every emotion we express we will be accountable one day in front of allah subhanahu wa taala and this is huquq al ibad this is not huquq allah this is huquq al ibad and huquq al ibad allah will not let it go without addressing this issue with the people who were affected by my bad action my emotions allah will not let it go until allah subhanahu wa taala will allow these affected people allah akbar